Good morning, good morning, good morning, everyone. This is your Hall of Famer, Director Marlon Green, synchronizing the universe with positive energy and applying pressure. I have good news. Good news, good news, good news, everyone. Our shadow governments and Luciferians of the world are losing strength. Did you hear what I say? I say the Luciferian and those under alien reptilian influence days are nearing an end. Let me tell you why. First of all, this is a call to leadership because the powers that be seems to like the fact that putting non-leaders or unaccomplished leaders in leadership positions is not going to get anything done. Uh, you all have to respect me because I have filed more legitimate civil rights, human rights, EEO rights than any other activists you know that are legitimate. A lot of these activists just be doing shit just to say, look at me or have a look at me contest. Our leadership of the world is highly dysfunctional. We do not support these special interest groups. We do not support the UK economic exploits in uh, Africa. We do not support the apartheid government of Israel and your reptilian neighbors that you favor so much are getting kicked out the galaxy because the cosmic energy that is approaching us, the reptilians cannot survive because of their negativity. And so they will be locked out of our solar system except for special circumstances for a thousand years. It almost sounds biblical, but you have to understand that these aliens are the gods of our myths. They are real and they had superpowers, but they're not going to tell you that you are and humanity of Earth is just as capable as they are. Also, the Galactic Feder well, the Federation Council is disbanding. You see, our government and these shadow governments and these deep state folks are very dishonorable and very treasonous. We need to leapfrog, catch up for us technology wise and join the rest of the galaxy because as long as they conspiring with the reptilians they don't even want us with basic resources to survive and these people on the earth with this alien dna have to be subject to inheritance laws we need to make formulas based on how much alien dna you have in your body that's the only way to take into account who owes what because these aliens have been conducting genetic experiments and been fucking us eating us and taking dna to enhance their own species without our permission and by us being uh young children in the galaxy they get to do what they want uh despite what we think well we have been a part unofficially of the federation of uh, extraterrestrial beings and this is being disbanded and there's going to be a galactic council or a universal slash galactic council that we have a permanent seat on there are many humanoid beings that look like us and some that don't look like us that exist throughout the universe our leaders are cowards and they talk about everything else but quality of life this this non-health care is a degradation of society and these luciferians that worship uh the reptilians like the queen and the pope and all the rest of you assholes your time is up because if you're not up to handling your responsibilities we are uh people like uh lynn buchanan and sean good and david wilcock are showing us the truth and you can't be aligned with God if you don't accept the truth we need to be better late better leaders better product producers better directors I have put in 
for being the next director on the Black Panther uh, comics because not only have I made my comics and my animation before Black Panther even came out, Ice Cube made the pitch and I supported it and I'm the first one to predict that Black Panther will make a billion dollars in sales despite its lack of leadership and homage to the real Black Panthers. That shit is about the end. Also, people throughout the world ain't shit. They are very dishonest and don't trust them until they deliver. I had legitimately uh, been in car accidents that was not my fault. And these lawyers and these judges and these insurance companies do conspire against regular people. I had to file discrimination complaints on the behalf of myself as a disabled veteran as long as as well as many complaints that I have done on behalf of the wounded warriors. Our leaders are cowards and they would only fight when they have the advantage. The extraterrestrials had destroyed Israel's weapon satellite and also the U.S. satellite that was uh, artificial intelligent e evil had got lost uh, being launched out of space by Elon Musk's SpaceX program. And let me tell you something. The mind is time and space. If your mind is prepared, there is almost unlimited potential. The rulers of this world are very negative and they know that we are traveling through an energetic part of our galaxy which will enhance our mental and social and cultural capabilities. They don't want that. They want you still eating out the garbage can. They want you dysfunctional. They want you to keep building nuclear technology. There is new medical technology out there. We have technology that can clear and clean nuclear radiation. You don't uh, treat radiation with chemical drugs and biological drugs. You treat radiation with laser therapy and other radiation light therapy and you can control or you can affect the way nuclear contamination is uh is lessened or made less effective over time it still takes a long time but our leaders don't know what the fuck they're doing like mike pence he does good after the president drops the moab bomb and he does bad by bringing the politics of bad spirit to the Olympics, which is not in the spirit of the games. They give these homosexuals these jobs because nobody argues them, just like they give that figure skater that job to uh, heckle uh, Mike Pence. And everybody can see the least common denominator or the common denominator is being gay and being Luciferian. Y'all secretly run the world with your luciferian agenda and uh y'all need to get y'all heads out y'all ass the reason why the aliens like earth men so much and the reason why the aliens like earth women so much is because we're the shit so if somebody is taking advantage of you and if somebody is trying to take what you got and if somebody is trying to mimic your behavior if someone is trying to copy your accomplishments, that means you're the shit. You can't tell me that you're willing to violate my human rights just to take some bodily fluids that you didn't pay for or you didn't deserve. And I'm supposed to listen at you? Our leaders are cowards. The Muslims didn't do 911. Not only the United States, but the world is spiritually unintelligent. The Galactic Council is forming. The Federal Council is disbanding. A lot of these bullshit rules was allowed by the Federal Council. I call shots throughout the United States and throughout the universe. Half of the universe knows who I am. Half the creation knows who I am. And also, you don't have to have superpowers to make a difference in your world. I'm more accomplished. Uh, I'm better at handling adverse uh, situations. I'm a born leader and those who ask to be put in position doesn't necessarily deserve to be put in that position. And the, re the reason why the aliens like us so much because we're the shit. 
They have long heads. They have wide heads. They have features that are not as aesthetic as ours. We have DNA that they want. We have minerals that they need. And it's time for them to play fair because as long as we let our ugly ass ways of our leaders dictate our foreign policies without us and our galactic policies without us, they're going to continue to play stupid and do the wrong shit. When it's deep space program and all of these other programs should be talked about, the Illuminati, the Cabal and other people like these are assholes. And y'all are cowards for continuing to let them control you with a minimum of resources and being influenced by the reptilians who don't want you with a damn thing. Not even with the resources for your species to survive and people like the Pope following. That shit is over.